bless my hands and bless in the blessings of the Lord, in the blessings of the Lord, my hands are blessed. Oh, in the blessings of the Lord, anything I touch have become to pass. Anything I do more come to bless my hands are in the blessings of the Lord. What shall I render? What shall I render? What shall I render to you, my Lord? I will exalt your name. I shout hallelujah. What shall I render to you, my God? Honor, glory, your be to the Lord in the highest. Hallelujah, Hallelujah. All our glory must be to the Lord in the highest. Hallelujah. Everybody shout Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. Oh, what shall I render? What shall I render? What shall I render to you, my God? I will exalt your name, I shout hallelujah. Oh, shall I render to you, my God? Father, we bless you, we worship you. I thank you for this moment and this hour. I thank you for this topic, so God, once again, to will bring unto our way. Thank you, Holy Spirit of the God, for making it again. Oh, Father, I thank you. I believe today is another day. I give a prayer platform. I welcome everyone. I welcome that brother, that sister. I welcome everyone that will come across this, this message today. May God bless you richly in the name of Jesus because we have done this message since last year. No, we have done part two and we do part two. Now this is a part three. We're going to finish here in part three. You know, I told you this is a real you. The real you. See the real you. The now a real you is a... The part three here a real you. So we, are, we, we don't waste time. Praise God. Holy, let's just worship God because we come before we come to this message. We know I will not waste time for the message. I want you to knock it in the head so that we know what we're talking about. The real you praise God. Holy, are you Lord? Oh, creation, call you God. What it is the name of the Lord. Worthy is the name. Worship your majesty, your majesty, also God. Hallelujah. Oh, great power. Oh, you are God. Mighty are your miracle. We stand in all, we stand in all your holy name. Hallelujah. Oh Lord, we bow and worship you. Lord, we bow, Lord, we bow and worship you. Lord, we bow, Lord, we bow. Oh, I worship you. Father, we thank you for this hour, for this moment. Father, we worship you. We bow, we worship the Lord. We bow, we exalt the King. We bow, we reverence the Lord, the King of all kings. I am to I am. Father, thank you, Lord, for this message. Allah. The Spirit of God has just made me to do it. It is just I'm be delaying over it. And today is another day to talk about this a real you. And I'm going to stop here in the part three. Praise God. You know, for the beginning for this real you are saying go to this part six, part seven. But the Spirit of God make me to end it here, part three. By the special grace of God, I go to end it here, part three. This a real you. Praise Master Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus Christ, for making it possible once again for this wonderful day, for this moment, for this hour, and this equal evening for we to use this 
as a, a spiritual food and the children of God for our to, to enrich our body because we already eat the, the, the food. We already eat the better food for our senses. We are eating so many and go to different friends. They know eat a kind of food, but this one is going to be the wonderful spiritual food in our spirit. Praise God. And God go to help us today by His grace, by His mercy, to make sure this spiritual food it come to it go to help us in the game. Hallelujah! Thank you, Jesus. Karabo soto li baba laba leko to lobo bo zibra dala ba sete ya dala rato to 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 ri ya kaya koto ya ba sete de brado bro sete ya ba seke ye ke tele bo sundo ba tele bo robo. We not waste time. We not waste time. By special grace of God, we will not waste time. My brother, my sister. My viewer all over the world, we will not waste time to talk about this real you. We will not waste time. We will not waste time in the name of Jesus. We will not waste time by the power of the Holy Ghost. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Masha Gayagada. Rakwa Sakotori Baba Soto Yagadagada. Le Kotori Brazo Brazidayaba. Ma Soto Bate Kata Koto Koto. La Godo Libra Gada Brasete Lebo Shada. We go don't waste time at all. We will not waste time. We will not waste time. We will not waste time to talk about this real you through the name of the Lord Jesus Christ. Our God is able to do a great and seedily abundantly above all that we are imagining, above all that we are thinking through our through the power of the Holy Spirit. And this real you, it come to me and the last year, you see in the December last year, it's come to me. I say, what is the real you? And God start to, to teach us, the Holy Spirit of God come to teach us what the real you mean. So we don't waste time. And Father Lord, have mercy upon us. Have mercy. And so many one that are coming today in this platform, Baba, have mercy. Have mercy. Have mercy upon my soul, my body, in the name of Jesus Christ. Hallelujah. Thank you for your mercy that I speak, that I break every joke, I break every barrier, that I break it. That mercy that we break everything that I'm not of God in our life. Today we break it. any mercy that we stop for we not to receive to be blessed by this mercy today. Every sin that we commit, any sin that we stop, that we still be embargo on our way. Today we have for the mercy of God to break it, to lose, to destroy it in our life. So that with the message that are coming for the throne of grace to enter us and to help us, to make us to see more what we have to do in this air time. Hallelujah. Praise God. Well, we not waste time to the power of the Holy Ghost. Thank you, Father, because your word say yes and say amen. Let's open our Bible to James. Praise God. Our Bible to James. Praise God. Hallelujah. Talabojada. La kotolo bo setelebo. You open your blood, open our Bible to James. That is where the topic is coming for. I want us just to knock it on the I don't want to go more longer. Hallelujah. So open your Bible to James. Praise God. Hallelujah. Let Togo say, brother, but say it. God is so wonderful. For remember us, so make sure say we end this. You know, I just know. I don't. I don't even ready today to really talk about it. But the spirit of God just help me. Me say, ah, my daughter, what do you waiting for? Oh yeah, talk about this real you. Let it end once and and once. Hallelujah. Cause I just that's why I just come. I say let's talk about it. So. What are we going to do now? Let's open our Bible to J1 and J121. The Bible says, Therefore, lay apart all the fittiness and all so. <laughs> it says, Lay apart all the fittiness and supportfully of the unrighteousness, on receiving with meekness on the ungrateful, on ungrateful world, which are able to save your soul. So what does he say about it? He say, receive the, the blessing, receive the word of God that we're able to build our soul, that we save our soul. Let look, let take away all the fitting garment, the fitting garment that are that not, that not qualified, the fitting garment of sin, the fitting garment of, uh, of uh, all, all righteousness, the fitting garment of life, all God forgiveness. Let put them away. Let come to save our soul. He say, but be ye a doer, be ye a doer, and that's what it's true in that J1. Say, be ye a doer, and not a hearer, only a no, not a hearer, holy, and receiving your whole self. He said, No, say, be a doer, a be ye a doer of the world, and not hearing only, and receiving who of yourself. He said, For if any man be a hearer of the world, and not doer, of is like unto a man. Behold, a natural face on the grass. 
Praise God. And 24 say, He said, For behold, it, he said, and he forgotten who is like, and his strange way, she forget what manner of man he was. Praise God. He forgets what man, man of man. He said, But who also look unto the perfect law? What is a perfect law? The perfect law of God, we go to discuss, let's not finish it. Also, the perfect law and the continually dear. The perfect law of God continually dear, and him be not unforgotful, hearing, but on the doer of the work, on this man shall be a blessing on this doer of the year. He said, so that very 25, we go to, we go to, go to, that let be a doer of the work. He said, what do you hear? The word of God that you hear it. You need to change your life. The word of God we are hearing, you need to build the hope. According to heart, let go to heart. Open your Bible to heart before we come back again. Heart, 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 heart. Praise Master Jesus. Open your Bible to heart. We are going to, the word, this word of God we are just hearing now is the one that's going to be a healing, deliverance of our soul. It's going to bring peace and joy whatsoever you have been looking for. So that we pray. But the word of God is everything in our life. Praise Master Jesus. Okay, open your Bible to that uh, look uh, at, at, at this is at, at, at it. So let's see something there by the special grace of the Holy Spirit. We will not waste time because I thought I want to eat it today. I want to finish it. Uh, to finish this uh, topic today. Hallelujah. The word of God that will help us to make sure sure we be what God wants us to be. In the heart 12, and let's go to 32. Praise God. I believe. Open your Bible there. Open your Bible there. And let's see what God has to us today. Who is His Spirit? Who is His power? The Bible says, not by mind, not by power. It says, by the Spirit. Hallelujah. If you are watching me, if you get it, you can help me put it there so that we talk about it. You are still happy also to know more and more about His kingdom. Praise God. Okay. Let's take it off here. Let's go to the... Let's go to the arts. Art 10. Art 10. Praise God. Art 10. Praise Master Jesus. Holy Spirit, we worship you. We give you praise. We adore your holy name. Thank you, Lord. He said, Art 10. Art 10. Art 10. Art. Let's see. Open your Bible to Art. Hallelujah. Glory be the name of the Lord. So, we go to see what the word of God he is. That we help us, what the word of God is in our life. The word of God, the Bible says in that very art, it says the word of God that we able to build us up. Everyone will know that because I don't want to waste our time. The word of God is the one that we build up. Hope. He referred to this uh, 25 of this J125. He said, But whosoever look unto a perfect law. What is the law? The law, the commandment of Jesus Christ. He has commanded all. He said, love your neighbor as you love yourself. He said, love your neighbor as you love yourself. That is the commandment of our Lord Jesus Christ. That is the commandment of our Father. That is the commandment of God to love our neighbor. And number two, he said, he said, bear not a, a fake weakness. Don't bear fake weakness to other. No lie, no do. No man, don't take another man wife, don't do all those. Don't say so. The commandment of our Lord Jesus Christ, that is the first commandment, third commandment. So after them, what is apple? He called to the, the word of God when Jesus Christ again, he got to give us some so simple, a simple a, 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 a instruction, the law. The love me, he said, we we'll love one another and obey the commandment of law. That John 15, because I like to get the one I need to get. Open your Bible to John 15. We don't waste time, praise God. Because the one I need to get already, John 15, hallelujah, 16. Open your Bible to there. He said, John 16, 24. He said, therefore, having yet asking nothing of a name, ask and yet shall receive that your joy may be full ask you shall receive the joy shall be full hallelujah and those things i have spoken unto you in in proverb but the time coming when i shall no more and speaking unto you in the proverb but i shall show you in the privilege of my father at that day ye shall ask my name i shall ask anything in my name and i say unto you that I will pray to Father for you. For the Father himself love you because ye have loved me and be 
leave that I come out for the God. He said, he said you believe that he's come out for our Father. And you believe. And everyone believes. And Jesus Christ come out for the Father. Praise Master Jesus Christ. That the very place I want to show us, he said, he said, he, you are his friend. He said, we are the say, behold. He said, behold, the hour is coming. Yet now coming. That ye shall scatter abroad. He said, I call you a friend. He said, 15. Okay. 15. Okay, open your Bible there. You can read it loud. Let people hear. Let people hear. Because we are talking about the word of God here. Praise God. Okay. Praise Master Jesus. He said, Ye are my friend. John 15, 14. You see what the Bible has said here? He said, Ye are my friend. If you do what, if you do whatsoever I command you to do. So the Bible is talking to us. He said, You are my friend. If we do what He command us to do, we are the friend of Jesus Christ. If we are do, we are following the step of our Lord and Savior. If we are following the way, welcome, man of God. Welcome, sir. If we are following the step of our father, he said, we are the friend of him. We are a friend. But if we are not following the step, we are maybe we are be following his step, suddenly we are going away on the step. Now, that means you are not neither a friend of him that command you. So the word of God here in that J1 25, he said, whosoever that are looking unto the perfect law. So everyone that are come to the looking unto the perfect law, what is the perfect law? Doing the way of the Father. What is the perfect law? Follow the step of Him that call you. If you are the small minister of God, you are the woman of God, you are the children of God, obey the master, obey the leader. Or the leader, who is the leader? The people that are behind before you. If they are really following God and calling to the way God has led them, follow them, follow them, obey them, respect them. You are respecting them, you are respecting God. Hallelujah. No, be dis no disobedience is not for God. Praise God. So, they see the real you. The Bible say, if any man be in Christ, he say, all things are passed away. He say, behold, all things can become new. That's 2 Corinthians 5.17. If any man be in Christ, all things shall pass away. He say, behold, all things shall be, all shall become new. That you don't know God be the way you be before. Your thinking are different according to Roma 12. He said, Be ye transformed. Ah, but so be ye transformed. Your renew of your mind. You mean to transform. You don't longer be the way you are. You all things are passed away. You are not be you are not the woman, a woman of God, a daughter of God, the son of God, the children of God that lie. You don't lie, you don't kill. You know, you don't compromise. You know, John, what people do, or because of people there, you, you pretend that everything is okay. After the people are gone, you, you, you turn, you turn, you change your, you now turn to ch chameleon. Chameleon that change. The way chameleon see a black, it will turn to black. When chameleon turn to, he see a white, it will turn to white. When some, you, you will no longer be the chameleon no more. You will not be a real child of God. You will not be a real daughter of the most high God. You will not be a real son of God. The Bible says in the Roman hate, in Roman hate 14, he say, has many that led by the spirit. He said they are the sons of God. You will not the spirit of God feel in you. You receive Jesus. Jesus had the personal as Savior, and you are filled with the power of the Holy Spirit. Now the Holy Ghost, the Spirit of God, is working, is using you to do the right thing. And when you are, you give a year to the Spirit of God to use you. Why they why a confusion full in the house of God today? Why so many people are doing things that are not that are not contrary to the thing of God today? It's because they lack the Spirit of God. They lack the Holy Spirit. They're not sensitive to the Holy Spirit of God. They, they so when they are not sensitive to the Holy Spirit of God, they are not to the spirit of God to lead there, so they will go to the lead the life of flesh. In that Roman head, it, it talk about a flesh, the work of flesh, the work of flesh. Because we don't go to go down to this uh, detail that very place now. That's why I want to do it to knock the head of the real you. To see a real you, you are doing, you are giving yourself to the spirit, you are healing yourself to the spirit of God to feel you, to lead you, to control you. You are not doing things of your own. You hear what God, the spirit of God, leads you. I'm just sitting down here, I'm not even doing anything. I just sit down, I'm just saying, I have to get my relax, and I'm walking the whole day today. But the spirit of God tell me, say, you need to talk about that real you, you need to finish it today. 
I don't even plan over this region now. I didn't plan. It, but I hear the word of the Holy Spirit say, daughter, finish that region. You. you say you're going to do part one, part two, part three, part four. So leave it for part three. Leave the region for part three. No, let's go. Let's walk to the Spirit. The Bible says, according to Galatians 5, 25, it says, if we are in the Spirit, let's walk in the Spirit. Now, this year, 2021, let all, let all this whole thing pass and let the new thing come to be unto our life. In that Romans 15, in 3, it says, it say, now ye are clean. In Romans 15, 3, it says, now ye are clean to the war which I have spoken unto you. As are many children of God and give it unto you to the word of God to clean them to clean that thing that God that didn't need or there how many sons of God how many daughters of God welcome anyone that are coming you are welcome God bless you how many daughters of the most High God that really give it yourself for the word of God to cleanse their home if you give yourself to the word of God to the word of God that is where the spirit of God comes to manifest through the word of God, that is where the spirit of God comes to be he tying he increasing in you. When you don't give yourself to the word of God, how can you hear for God? How can the spirit of God increase in you? That is why many of us today in the ministry, in the church of God, in the, in the house of God, in the body of Christ, we are missing it because we don't give ear to the spirit of God. We so we have we are listening to ourselves, do something for God. If we are listening to ourselves. We cannot get the real us. Because the real us is not connected to the Spirit of God. The real us lack the Spirit of God. So now we don't give, we don't connect to the Spirit of God for the real us to connect to the Spirit of God to, to bring the message, the, the, bring the message, the what God wants to let us know. Sometimes this God wants to talk to us. God wants to talk to his children by himself. He don't want to talk to any man. Sometimes when God didn't see you, are so busy. And so many of us, we are so busy for God to speak to us. We are busy about children. We are busy about our husband. We are busy about our wife. We are busy about our working place. We are busy for the Spirit of God is so hard time to minister to us. So our the real us will not come to manifest. The real us will always go down. But we are the children of God. We are the sons of God. Because our, we are not giving ourselves to the Spirit of God to minister to our soul. We, we, we like a, the, the, the flu. We, we are walking in, we are hearing ourselves and we are walking what we are hearing in ourselves. We are doing it. But with this, we are doing the word of God. That is what, that make a body of Christ in this earth time. Many things have been happened. Many things have been given. Many things have been happened in the church of God all over the world. You see such a argument, argument of argument, of disobedience of disobedience. They know no, no respect in anything. No, he fear. The fear of God already died for the many children of God. Because they are not giving their self, they are not hiding their self to the spirit of God, so that the fear of God had to come to them. Praise Master Jesus. When the fear of God didn't come to you, you don't, you don't give yourself to the Spirit of God for the fear of God to come. There is no way you go to have the real yours. I praise Master Jesus. So God needs you, need the real you. The real you more to speak at this year. The devil like it or not, I command every blockade that broke in the year of the children of God for them not to listen to the word of God. Every blockade that are blocking their mind, that are blocking their mind for them not to sense it to the Spirit of God. Today I come against them in the name of Jesus Christ. Today I come against them in the blood of Jesus Christ. That is why the devil have the access to the children of God. They are catching them. They always, always build them. You will see somebody that are burning in fire, 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 fire. Suddenly you see the fire go down. Someone already go, go, go. You see suddenly he backslides because they are not giving their spirit to the connect it to the real, the, the, to be the real day. The real day, that is what God connects you to. You, God don't need your carnality. He don't need your flesh. This is the flesh. God don't need it. But God needs your spirit, your spirit man. And when your spirit man continues to meditate on the thing of God, you're going to look onto the thing of God. You will see the real you will come to come at. You will see them say, this person, I know her before. This man, I know him before. I see the life, he just changed. You that not even don't know, know how to read Bible. You don't even know how to you don't even know how to greet somebody before. You just see yourself, you see start greeting somebody. You just see yourself carry for you are calling people. Hello, God bless you, God bless you. The real you are coming at. 
The reason you cannot, the reason you cannot jealous, the reason you cannot gossip, the reason you cannot see the iniquity to dwell on iniquity, the reason you lack a good thing, the reason you lack a love, the reason you lack a caring, the reason you he needs a want somebody to a someone like you, the reason you don't fight, the reason you when you see where the argument is, you want to make a peace. The reason you want to make a peace. The Bible says, bless according to Matthew 5. Oh, let go there. Father, I want to say thank you today. I didn't want to let all clear for this reason so that many, top many topics is still coming. In Matthew 5, we go to say, say, he said, blessed, nine, like Matthew 5, 9. The Bible says, blessed are the peacemaker. He said, they shall be called the children of God. A real you, when you see where the a disagreement it is, the real you want to make a consolation. You want to make the consolation. You want to make a peace. He said, "Blessed are the peacemaker." He said, "They shall be. They shall be called the children of God." The real you don't need anything, anything equity. Anything that not giving you one piece. The Bible says, God, God so loved the world, He gave the Holy Begotten Son. And whosoever believes will not perish. So, if because you believe in Christ, you are following the step of Christ. You everything about you change. Your arm of it change. Your self change. The, the way you are walking, self is changed. What you are doing, self is changed. Your speech is changed. Your, your laugh is changed. You no, know, they read you. People will, must, people will see Jesus Christ in you. You let people know the whole world see Jesus Christ in you. Say, yeah, this very man, this very woman, yeah, yeah he's a son of God, he's a daughter of God. Because they read you are coming out. When they read you, he's not coming out. Some people pretend it to be, they'll say they, they are really doing it well. But that is not what God says. No, I've said something. I say, not be, the way they read you, did it come out? She will be like a camelot. Camelot can see white, it will be white. It will see red, it will be red. But we are children of God, we are not like that. Because that is the work of the center. The work of the devil to deceive the children of God. To make sure they think that they are doing it well, whether they are not doing it well. That is the people the Lord say. He said, many call. He said, few are choosing. We will not be the we will not be many, but we are going to be the few that are choosing. I'm going to come to pray to tell you, my brother, my son, over the world. This is another day of this real you to end this pattern on it. So this real you is a thing that God really needs for us. That this end time, God needs the real you to make sure to connect to you. So that God wants to speak to you, he cannot talk to you. He wants to let you, maybe something wants to happen to you, he cannot speak to you. Because you are giving yourself to yourself to hear. You are not sensible on the thing of the spirit. You don't let the spirit of God, your own spirit, sharp connect with the spirit of God. So how can God talk to us? How can God let us know? So that way you will, you only sleep, you dream, you forget your dream. Because your spirit is so weak. Your spirit is so weak. He said, can a man, a can a man cannot hear for God. A can a man, he cannot hear according to Roman 8. Open your Bible there. So go to hell it there because I don't want to take our time. We go to hell it there because this is a time. This is a time. We don't let a fair prophet, all these fair prophets, they are full everywhere. Babala will not, they come to altar. Fair prophet, they are everywhere. They are deceiving people. They are telling people, bring money, so see, don't do, do this. You want the fair prophet to deceive you, collect your money. If you don't connect yourself to the real, they, they, they connect yourself to the power of the Spirit of God. The fair prophet will come, will deceive you. All that one will come, will deceive you. Because your spirit is very lack. It lack the, it lack the thing of God. Your spirit lack the thing of God. Because you are hearing he read you. You are hearing yourself. Okay. Self so let's go to Roma 12. Roma, uh, Roma 12 says first. He said, I beseech you, one. I beseech you, therefore, brethren, by the mercies of God, that ye present your body, your body as a living sacrifice, holy and acceptable to God, which is your your, your reasonable service. And be not be comfort to this war, but be ye transformed by renew, by renew of your mind, that ye may be proved that what that good and acceptable, perfect way of God, see, is this a perfect? What is a perfect? That is what we see here in that 25. It's 25. It says, it says, but whosoever looked unto the perfect law, whosoever looked unto the perfect law in that J, that we are, we are, that is our hardcore mission of the patrol of this region, one, two, three. 
So if you ever look unto the perfect law, the perfect law, look at what he said. He said, oh, a perfect law of the liberty, continue there. He said, it shall be not of the, of the forgetful, yearly, but to doer of the work. This man shall be blessed on this day. Ah, you shall be blessed if you do the word of God. You shall be blessed if you follow the step of Christ. You shall be blessed for knowing Christ. You shall be blessed not to disobey. You shall be blessed to, not to look what others are doing. Because the head time has come. You know, the Bible says many have come. So few have chosen. So when we are ready, say the perfect way of God. So look, let's go to that Roman 8. They say that's Roman 8. Let's finish it. And there's a place I want to read for us. Praise Master Jesus. Dharma He said, For the for the spirit, he said, for to be kind of my day. In Roman He says, He said, For come not my day is what he said. He said, He is dead. But be spiritually my day in life is a life and a peace. He said, he said because the kind of mind is empty against God, for it is not. Subject to the law of God, neither indeed can be. You see what we are reading? He said, The carnal man is dead. So, if we let the real us this year speak for us, we will continue to be moving forward. You will see yourself at the top. You will see yourself, you there, that people are looking at it. Look at her. You will see yourself, you are moving, fly, you are flying, you are flying. You will see yourself, you are talking, you that are shade. You, you, will, you see that shade, that spirit of shade, he, he take it away. Spirit of fear, he go away on you because you give yourself to the spirit of God. There are so many people that fear, and this morning they fear, fear, fear because your spirit of God is on, he knows you. According to a, a uh, second, uh, second Timothy 7, second Timothy 7, there in 14. I think second Timothy 1 7. He said, He said, The Lord God have not given you the spirit of fear, but the spirit of, of the son of the bonus or love or the sound mind. That is what God has given unto us. So, why are we fearing? So, let the real horse come out. Bruce your religion out this year and let the spirit of God connect to your religion. And so that you will, that is why you will not fear anything. That is why you will walk onto the go the business of God. That is why you will see people will see you. They'll say, ah, this man, the way she do it here, I don't understand it. Because your real you are connected to Christ. And God will come to be speaking to you. And you will go to hear God and hold that hearing God. Why do you allow the man deceive you? You allow a fellow human deceive you because you are not giving yourself to the real you to the, the God to speak to the real you, the real you to come and if any man be a Christ. It's a new creation. All things shall pass away. Many of us, we don't let all things pass away. We still dwell in the whole thing. So that's why we, our spirit man, always, we always dwell, he's not connected to the, the, the thing of Christ. May God bless us tonight as we listen to this message. And today, the final state, the final state of this real you, and may God make sure your real you, the Bible say the word of God is a thing that everything say. He said, we are to be a doer. He said, be a doer according to that 23. He said, if any man hearing his word and not doer of his life unto a man who holding his natural face a glass, May God help us today. I pray for everyone that has come to this light today. May God bless you. May God make you know more of in Him and see more of Him and know you know more of to see know why you are in this hell. The purpose God has called you here. May God let you see it in the name of Jesus Christ. I pray for you today. For there, this message come to I come to finish the pattern today. Everything about you that they, they not be growing, that not be moving today. I pray. May God manifesting and may God bless you and your house or your family anything that not be working well in you I command it to be continue to be manifest continue to work in by the power of the Holy Spirit in the name of Jesus Christ may the word of God continue to be increasing in you may you continue to be a doer of the word of God not just a hearer in the name of Jesus Christ may God bless you today as you listen to me I love you all as you come on Thursday next week let me open our heart come to pray to my pray the Bible say uh, 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 he said, pray always. We need to pray always. We, we can pray or we pray always. So come with all your heart desire. Come with your mind. 
and let God, let God to join our faith together to pray to intercede to any any area of our life that we need prayer. Come with your heart sincerely and let come and pray. And you go to see the good God of Israel, the good God of Abraham of Isaac. Go to see all through in the name of Jesus. I bless everyone that I come today. May God bless you. May God reach you. May God bless your heart and your family in the name of Jesus Christ. I love you all. I love you all. As we share the grace, the grace of our Lord Jesus Christ, the love of God, and sweet fellowship by the Holy Spirit. Rest and abide with us forever. Surely goodness and mercy shall follow us all the days of our life. We shall dwell in the house of the Lord forever. Amen. The peace of God rest upon your heart and your family. In Jesus' name, amen. I love you.